Hey everyone, this is Scott from CertMedia.com and in this video I'll be covering how to disable the theme and plugin editor in WordPress. First off, I want to comment that you should never use these editors because they're very common to not saving, causing your code to be wiped out and leaving you with a white screen of death. They're also a very common way for users to inject code that's either malicious or unintentionally malicious into their website. A common way that hackers will get into your website is they'll upload a PHP file containing a WordPress administrator login, and then they will use the theme and plugin editors to inject code into the website. So the, it's almost always a best case scenario for this feature to be completely disabled altogether. And if you're not able to use file manager in your cPanel or you're able to use FTP, I'll show you how to do so strictly from using the w, in WordPress using the WP file manager plugin. All you need to do is install this plugin, WP File Manager. I'll include a link in the description so that way you can easily find it. And then we're going to click on it to open up our files. You're then going to search for wp-config.php. You're going to right click on it and open the code editor. And then we're going to paste this code which I am going to put in the description below. It is define disallow file edit true. You can paste it effectively anywhere above the base configuration for WordPress. Just make sure you're pasting this after this opening PHP tag. Then you're going to go ahead and hit save and close. To verify that the feature is working, if you go to appearance and theme editor, because we haven't reloaded, these menu items are still listed, you should be getting a warning that says you are not able to access this page. After doing so, we're going to go to the dashboard and see if those links are still there. As it looks like the plugin and theme editors have been deleted, what we're now going to do is we're just going to simply disable and delete the WP File Manager plugin. And that's all there is. You've now made your site more secure and you've led yourself to be less finicky with the code. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask in the comments section below. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching and goodbye.